Welcome back. I'm Jane Rogers. So we have talked about NMN as an NAD booster, but there's another powerful one. It's a natural compound in the skin of grapes called resveratrol, and it is one of the molecules found in red wine. Resveratrol is a master NAD booster. NAD usually declines with age, but it's critical to keep NAD up at more youthful levels. Why? Because NAD is the fuel for an important enzyme called sirtuins. Sirtuins have the ability to turn genes on and off and control our health, our fitness, and our very survival. We don't have to worry about low NAD and low sirtuins when we're young. And that's why cancer and heart disease and dementia, the diseases of aging, don't generally strike the young. But as those birthdays pile up, low NAD levels go hand in hand with low sirtuin levels. And that's why the older we get, the more we succumb to the diseases of aging. So the goal is to keep NAD up. And by doing that, you keep sirtuins up and you prevent disease. But you have to drink hundreds of glasses a day of red wine to get the kind of doses that are efficacious. One must take it in another form. Personally, I take a thousand milligrams, which is one gram of micronized trans resveratrol in pill form every day. There are a couple things you want in this supplement. Number one, you want the trans resveratrol form. That's the form that activates the sirtuin enzyme. Other forms of resveratrol in studies didn't do that. Number two, you want micronized. That's for human bioavailability. An early Dr. Sinclair study found that levels of resveratrol in the blood were 3.6 times greater when using micronized formulations. Number three, you also want 98% of the pill to be pure resveratrol and not other things. You can get diarrhea with a pill that contains only 50% resveratrol because you're also getting a whole bunch of other stuff in that pill. And number four, it's important to take transresveratrol with a food that contains a fat. Think yogurt or olive oil. Dr. Sinclair's studies show that without fat, resveratrol absorption was five times lower. And finally, from a Dr. Sinclair interview with Rhonda Patrick, we learn to store resveratrol out of the light and heat. Light turns it brown, and it won't be effective then. Extreme heat isn't good either, but neither is refrigeration and possible moisture contamination. Well, with all that, where do you turn to get your resveratrol? For sourcing, I have a big list below from fastlifehacks.com where you can get this 98% micronized trans resveratrol in pill or powder form. And remember, you're wanting all of this because resveratrol boosts NID, which in turn boosts sirtuins, which in turn prevents the diseases of aging. How does it do this? Well, one of the things it's doing is mimicking caloric restriction. And when we see resveratrol given to these rodents, what the biggest surprise was, was that they were protected against a high-fat, so-called Western diet. Those mice on resveratrol, even though they were really obese on this really chunky meal, they lived as long as the lean mice that we had as the control group. And that was really, as far as I know, the first study of any that showed that you could mimic caloric restriction with a molecule and be fat, but live as healthy as a lean animal. Also in animals, anti-cancer activity and mitochondrial boosting has been seen. In humans, resveratrol has been shown to improve fasting glucose and insulin sensitivity. Those two findings happened in 2019. In 2020, it was found to lower total cholesterol and raise good cholesterol, HDL. It improves metabolic and cardiovascular markers. Resveratrol reduces inflammation and oxidative stress in healthy people. And it improves memory for the obese, but otherwise healthy, 50 to 75-year-olds. And for the fun of it, does this anti-aging intervention stuff work? Dr. Sinclair's photo in 2009 compared to one 10 years later in 2019. In the first, he is 40. In the second, he's 50. Yes, he's better lit in the 50-year-old picture, but he certainly hasn't aged much in 10 years, has he? In fact, don't you think he looks younger? May we all be so fortunate. I hope this was helpful. 
May we all live better longer in health. Have a great day. <music>